Hi, I'm Mark Collins. I'm the chef of Circa 1886, and today I'd like to kind of go through um, fall. And we're in the fall and winter here, and, and these months bring obviously warm feelings and warm flavors. We like those things right now. So I'm going to talk about one item in particular, which is a, a, basically string squash or spaghetti squash. Uh, these are in peak season from the fall through the winter. Um, you were look, kind of looking for a, a nice firm squash that has a nice yellow throughout the whole thing. Green ones are a little underripe, so we don't want to. We want to kind of avoid those. And what we do with these, we split them in half, and then we put them in the oven, and allow them to bake up until they get super soft and fork tender, and then we scrape them out while they're still hot, and we get these strands that we have right here. And we're going to make a salad of those today. We take these strands, and then we caramelize some onions, which we have here. We have chestnuts, some chopped sage, some micro celery, and then we have like a celery vinaigrette and a celery espuma or foam that we're going to garnish this with. Now what we've done is taken a cylinder, this PVC pipe, packed it half full with the, uh, the cooked off squash and then put the caramelized onions in the middle and then topped it again with the squash. Now we're going to plate this up really quick and show you what it looks like. We have our espuma which is basically a juiced celery. Um, and a little gelatin, it's allowed to be put into a canister and foamed up. So we'll add some of that to our plate here. You see it comes out nice and creamy. It's got a really light flavor to it. When we're done with that, we'll unmold our salad right into the center of that. Kind of push that out because it will hold its shape nicely. That will sit right there. Garnish this plate with a couple of roasted chestnuts, a little bit of the uh, chopped mint sage for a nice flavor, and then our celery vinaigrette, which just kind of gets drizzled over the top. Got a nice flavor to it. And then garnish it with some micro celery. It's a really wonderful salad. It's light, but yet it gives you those feelings and flavors of fall that we're looking for. It's, it's really easy to make. Come in and try it.